That's better. Can you hear me out there? <laughs> do you want to hear some music instead of me? <laughs> so do I. Put your hands, please. You're going to love this. As I always do every time I see them. I always come back for more. The beautiful and talented Aurora! <laughs> Good evening. We are mastering the uh, electronique a minute ago. We might have managed it now. We're going to start with a, a groovy number based on a friend of ours. Maybe you can guess who it is. Paul might need something on his uh, signaling desperately for a signal. The chorus will give it away straight away. Breathe. No 
come be here. Big up. Thank you. Project. I think Lossie's vocal is a little bit low, but we're going to go what we can. And uh, once again, I know. Yeah. Once again, it seems that most songs that we uh, compose are about things we see and know, as we all can. Without further ado, a little bit more volume on that one, and then we can go into. Never mean. That's the autobahn. Motor. The 
Thank you very much. You're so kind. We started a bit late. We've got one more. We're going to wind up in about a pretty, pretty uh, couple of few minutes. Thank you very much. Last one. We've been in a war, right? You've been good. We're going to get together last few years.
Dancers, Kane and Kim, thank you. And Chris came in earlier. And Ken and all the helpers. Including, including the welcome return of the Aurora Ants in the background. Woo! Okay, now at the moment we've got the Invisible Opera Company of Tibet playing on the cosmic stage. If you like your gong, esoteric stuff. And in about 20 minutes or so in here, if you like your rock music, we're going to have the mighty Litmus. So don't go too far away. Oh, yes. One more time, please, Aurora. <laughs> 